Hey boys and girls, it's Miss White. And I wanted to show you the math wall in our classroom. So we're gonna catch up a little bit and talk about the things that we do for calendar math every morning. So for calendar math, we're gonna talk about the month and this month is September. And today is September the 10th. So I need to add the number 10 to the calendar. So today is Thursday, September 10th, 2020. Over here, I have the days of the week, and I know you can't see me, but listen, the days of the week are Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. So, do you know what today is? This is a little marker that we're going to put where it says today is. What day of the week is today? Well, if I look at my calendar, today is Thursday. So, I need to find Thursday on the days of the week chart and put today is next to Thursday. So let's see, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Today is Thursday. Yesterday was, well if today is Thursday, yesterday was the day before. So if today is Thursday the 10th and yesterday was the 9th. So yesterday was Wednesday. So we're going to put this on Wednesday. Tomorrow will be, what will tomorrow be? Tomorrow will be Friday. So we're going to put tomorrow will be next to Friday. All right, so what season is it? It still feels like summer outside, doesn't it? Miss White thinks it feels like summer, but since it's September, it is really fall, even though fall is still really hot, isn't it? It is right now. So we're gonna put the season is fall. And fall is when the leaves start changing and it starts getting cooler at night. You might spend a little bit, bit more time outside. Maybe you have a fire pit and you like to sit outside when it gets chilly and roast some marshmallows. But the fall is the season, okay? And this says today's weather is blank and blank. Well, since Miss White's here by herself and she has to decide Miss White is going to say that today's weather is hot and sunny. It is super hot outside. When, when Miss White came into work this morning, she had the air on in her car. It was so hot already. So I'm going to put hot and sunny. Now we're also going to use this to keep up with how many days we've been in school. We haven't been doing this yet, but we have been in school for 21 days. And I want you to look at the B. Each one of these moves by itself, and I don't know if you can see it that well on the camera, but every five beads is a different color. They rotate colors. So this is a group of five. And this is a group of five. This is a group of five. So you see how that works? So if we've been in school for 21 days, Miss White is going to count 21 beads. But do I have to count them one by one? No, I can count by five. So let's count by five to get to 20. So we have Five, 10, 15, 20. Now, if we've been
been in school 21 days and I have 20 beads over there, how many more beads do I need? Did you say one? If you did, you're right. So I'm going to slide one red bead over and that shows that I've been in school for 21 days. Can you believe we've been doing virtual school for 21 days already? It doesn't seem like it's been that long, does it? So we have our calendar. Today is Thursday, September 10th, 2020. Today is Thursday. Yesterday was Wednesday. And tomorrow will be Friday. So we've been in school for 21 days. You're going to help me keep counting that. All right, boys and girls, I hope you enjoyed looking at our calendar math wall. And we'll be visiting from this area again soon. Bye.